Well, tonight a high school coach is in the Osceola County Jail accused of sexual misconduct with at least two students. News 6's Carolina Cardona was there as the sheriff walked that 43-year-old to a patrol car. And as she reports, deputies think there could be more victims. Thanks to the brave students for coming forward and exposing this guy for the monster that he is. Osceola County Sheriff Marcos Lopez providing details on the arrest of Samuel Enrique Figueroa, accused of lewd conduct with students at Celebration High School. The victims of Mr. Figueroa are all teenage girls and they all describe individual contacts with Mr. Figueroa, where he did and said various sexually inappropriate things. Lopez says the investigation began after a parent came forward with information about the suspect. In one case, he instructed a student to go into the girl's bathroom and take pictures of her breasts and send him these pictures. In other cases, he made vulgar sexual remarks regarding how several students looked and how their bodies get them sexually aroused. Figueroa had been working at Celebration High School since August of 2018, according to Osceola County School District. The 43-year-old was an assistant baseball coach and an assistant girls basketball coach. Further investigation and interviews yielded several other female juvenile victims, ages ranging from 15 to 18 years of age, who also attended Celebration High School. He will hopefully be staying in jail for a long time. He has abused his power. He has abused his position and is a sexual deviant who was lurking in our schools. The sheriff's office saying all of the incidents took place on school property. And it's not the first time Figueroa has been in trouble. The only criminal history he has right now is in 2018 when he worked for the clerk of the court's office. He uh, got charged uh, for a battery against an employee. Figueroa is expected to be charged with lewd and lascivious molestation, lewd and lascivious conduct, and an unlawful use of a two-way communication device, among other charges. In Osceola County, Carolina Cardona, News 6.